I'm a first-generation American and a first-generation college graduate. But before I was any of those things, I was a Communities and Schools student. I met Ray back in, I want to say, his sophomore year in high school. He was a very uh, intelligent young man coming in to interview for a pre-college program. And um, he had the desire to get a higher education and just needed help getting there. When I met Miss Bell, she exposed a new world outside of high school that I couldn't find at home, I couldn't find from my neighbors or my family. And she was that gateway, and CIS brought her to our school, brought her to my life, and completely changed the way that my path was being established. It's not something that's easy. These are kids that have never been maybe three miles out of their neighborhood. Specifically, Ray had never been. We wanted to push him a little bit higher. Let's go for these Ivy League schools. There's nothing to lose. So I applied to a school that I didn't know anything about called Stanford. Um, I didn't even know where in the country it was. As soon as I graduated from college, I realized that if I was going to create an impact on any community, that it would be in the one where I was born and raised. Watching Ray and watching his work and being able to say he came from communities and schools, it definitely makes me feel like I know why I do what I do. And we're grateful that Ray is getting the recognition for not just his accomplishments, but for him coming back and giving back. We were in the hallways that I was walking through as a high school student here at South Sand High School. To think that I get to come back here, speak to students in a way that I've been invited to do. Good afternoon. Is more than I can ask for because all I can ask for is, is an ability to try to give back to folks who've done so much for me. When I see these students, I see incredible potential. And we should see that for every young person in this country. And for them, they are sparkling for the American dream. We need to make that real. It's not just a, a dream, it should be a reality. And groups like Communities and Schools make that American dream a reality.